Hi guys, Wendy here. In this video, we're going to draw my Draw So Cute Fox. So let's get started. With this fox, we're going to first start by drawing the little tuft of hair on top of his head. So right here, I'm going to draw two zigzags. Just like that. And then from there, I'm going to start to bring down a curve for his head. So I'm going to come over here and bring down a curve. So same thing on this side. Okay, and then from there, I'm going to flare it out a little bit. About this much, we're going to keep coming down. So same thing on the other side. And then from here, I'm just going to flare it out a tiny bit. So let's make sure it's about the same on the other side. So I'm going to come here and give myself a point and flare it out. So from there, we're going to start to bring it in with a curve. So same thing on this side. And just keep coming around right here. And same thing here. Okay, so that's the shape that you're aiming to draw right here for his um, head. So from there, let's bring in his big ears. So right here, I'm going to start to draw a curve up around this area right here. So about right here, I'm just going to come about right here and draw a curve down. And right here, bring it all the way down. Some nice big ears. And I'm going to come inside right here and just follow my outside line. So this side right here is going to be thinner. And this part is going to be wider. So let's do the same thing on the other side. So I'm just going to go right across, give myself some points. So this is going to all the way across, right there, and I'm going to bring my curve up. So, well, that's, it's easier for me to go down. So I'm going to come over here, about right here, and I'm going to draw a curve down. And right here, I'm going to connect it back. So from there, let's draw the inside ones again for the ear. So it's going to be wider over here. Go up and then thinner on this side. There, so now let's bring this cute little fox to life. So towards the bottom right here, pretty low right here in the center, we're gonna draw his nose first. So I'm gonna come about right here and draw a small little curve right in the center. And then I'm going to, okay, so from there, that's his nose and we're gonna bring in a curve that goes all the way out to here. So I want to make it a very soft, thin curve because um, it's just basically the top of his head where it's just orange and the, the wider part right here at the bottom. So to separate it, so I don't want it too dark. So I'm going to come here and aim to draw a thin curve that comes all the way down to there. And then same thing on this side, I'm just going to bring down a soft curve. So if you're using a pencil at home, you don't even have to draw this line. It could just be a line where you know where to color it orange and um, cream color. There, kind of wobbly because I was trying to make it very thin. And then from there, we can go ahead and draw the eyes. So I'm going to come right in this area right here and draw a circle right kind of in the center of this line. Okay, so same thing on this side right there draw another circle okay so then to make them draw so cute eyes I'm gonna come in here with two small circles so I'm just gonna strategically place it <laughs> and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top This curve right here, you can draw it first just so you know where to kind of place your eye. But if you're using a pencil, of course, um, just erase that line right here. So I'm going to strategically place my circles and curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. And the lines at the bottom. Okay, so I got his two little eyes in. Now let's come up here, uh, about right here, and I'm going to draw a little curve 
on top of his eye to anchor his eyes. And then at the bottom, if you want, you can leave him like this, or if you want, you could give him a cute little um, mouth. So in the center right here, I'm basically going to draw a very flattened out W and cap it off. Okay, now to draw his body. So we're going to center his body. So about right here, I'm going to bring out a curve and here. And I'm going to bring down a nice long curve like that. Then from there, I'm going to draw the little tuft of hair, fur, that he has on his um, chest area. So I'm going to come about, let's see here, about right here and draw a curve out. So same thing on this side and then bring it in and curve it out again and back in. So everything is aiming for this center area right here. So from there, we're going to come and draw his legs. So from this point right here, just make sure you kind of have your center. So I'm going to come here and just give myself a point about right in this area. And that's how far I want his legs to be. I'm going to bring down a curve. Same thing on this side. So once again, I'm aiming for the center. So go down lower and we're going to start to curve it out for his legs. So from when we come down here, we're going to bring it out. So same thing on this side, bring it out. And then from there, we're going to come about right here and draw his arms. So tapering, bring it in and connect it. So same thing on this side, about right there. And connect. And then right here for some details for the fur, you can come in here and just draw some zigzags for his, um, the fur. Okay, and then from there, let's bring this down a little bit more. And we're going to bring out his um, back leg. So we'll come out here with a curve and bring it out and tuck it in the same area. So same thing here. And just kind of connect it with a, some zigzag soft curve. And then right here, just pop out a little foot curve and then bring it in. So same thing on this side, pop it out and just bring it in. And now the most favorite part of a fox that I love is his tail. So right in this area right here, I'm going to pop out a huge curve. So say about right here, I'm going to bring out a big curve, go all the way up and bring it all the way back down. and tuck it back in. So then in here to separate the two colors, just come in here and just draw some zigzags. And then it's gonna come around like that. And of course, cause this is a draw so cute fox, I have to put, give him a little heart. <laughs> so I'm gonna put a little heart right here to make it mine. And of course he's outside, so we draw some grass and my dandelions. So there, I hope you guys loved how my little fox turned out. And if you do, please give me a thumbs up and share it. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.